Hey, what's up, everybody? My name is Sixteen Shadow. Welcome back to episode of a video game discussion. Today, we'll be talking about Sonic Mania digital pre-order official trailer. So, today, I, I just want to point out that yes, I am very aware of the trailer. I know I'm like basically almost a day behind or half a day. I think it's a half a day, but so okay. I know about all the trailers from Sonic Mania up to this point. I haven't spoken much about some of them. I think the last one I spoke about Sonic Mania was the Flying Battery Zone, and not the second part of the trailer that started showing up like I think two weeks later. Not that, but just the original first Flying Battery Zone trailer. So since then, yes, I have learned more things about Sonic Mania. Uh, I, I just want to point out that this trailer is not going to be telling you about everything I learned. It's just everything that I have learned in the trailer of what we've been showing off today, of course, basically. So first, I like to point out that. And, and yes, a lot of this information will be coming from also Game Explain. Please go check out their video too. They go way in depth of some things I didn't even pay attention to. And I just want to say big shout out to them. Of course, well, I, I watch them like all the time. Not every freaking video they, they upload, of course. But I love listening to their discussions because I personally like to discuss videos as well. So, I do like the menage. The menage. The montage? No. The, the, the reference, I guess you could say. Uh... That they uh, throw in for, you know, Sonic being trying to be me into a, like a rabbit, a bunny, because that's originally what Sonic was supposed to be, and then they changed it up to a hedgehog. Uh, I like that because I I didn't catch it the first time, but I kind of watched it the second time around because I felt like I saw something where I was wrong, and I was like, oh, you know what? I didn't catch it the first time. So I like how that's you know there. Now I like the whole sketch art thing because it just like shows it's there, you know. Like, I don't know, I just like about it. I don't really think they really show sketch art like things in the past of Sonic. So I thought it was a very good different kind of like feel of watching for a trailer. Of course, you know. So Sonic's running with like Flickies, which is the animals to Sonic uh, franchise. And you know, they're like, oh hey, we're saved and, and all that stuff. So, so of course, we're seeing uh, uh, a zone called uh, something Illusion or uh, oh, freaking A. Uh, delusion or Mont? No, no, Mont. I kept thinking of words, but it's not coming to mind. Uh, like it's a desert place. I, the name had it. I had the name, and then it's gone. So when I was watching it, I'd like, oh, hey, there's a new desert zone. I don't think I paid attention to the desert zone before, because I knew it was announced, but I didn't really look at it. Uh, a, a mirage, mirage, something, mirage, something. That's what I remember. Um. At first, I was like, you can switch all characters out on the, on the Flash, which I don't think you really can, but I, th I thought it was just pretty cool if you could. Um, but, uh, you know, and then one thing that Game Explain did point out, I didn't realize about the whole, uh, the whole, uh, uh, that one enemy that's like a beetle and goes into a ball. I didn't know that that when, when he attacked, you know, Sonic jumped the same time. I didn't pay attention to that. Which I gotta say, that's pretty freaking awesome. That'd be pretty interesting if, you know, follows you all the way through to the end of the, the level or just stops and stays on this track or what, you know? So that's something I don't really know. Uh, also, when we get to the part where Tails is like in some kind of like junkyard or something, and you see all these destroyed uh, egg bots and, and televisions and all that jazz, I I didn't think much to it because, I don't know, like it's not the first time I've seen Tails in a... Uh, like you know, like a like a dumpster kind of like area. I don't know, like uh, because I'm not thinking 2D Sonic. I'm thinking more Sonic Adventure 3D. You know, uh, you know, like the sewer thing from Casino uh, Opulus, Casino Casino whatever. It was Casino Opulus. Um, it's not like there was trash, trash, but it supposed to be like tr there was trash. You know, um, that's kind of kind of remind me of that. <laughs> It'd be pretty cool. There's a Sonic Adventure reference in here, which I don't really know. But it'd be cool if there was. Um, of course, I, I like the music that's playing during the trailer. I, I thought it was, of course, great. I think it's by Hyper Potions again. I think. It's the same people that was doing the whole DJ shit at the Sonic Summer thing. Or whatever it was. <laughs> I forgot. And it wasn't the greatest. Except there was like a ton of freaking Chow Garden music. And I was getting uh, pumped and hyped for like Chow Garden Adventure HD or something. Like by, by itself. Like a standalone game. Uh, Sega, guys, by the way, you really do need to make that. I mean, people are dying for a Chow Garden like 3. We have it in Sonic Adventure 2. We have it in Sonic Adventure DX Rector's Cut. Where is Chow Garden 3? <laughs> we need Chow Garden Adventure 3. Come on, come on. Well, like, like I, I understand the whole big, big, 
Fishing Adventure 3, but we probably need a Chow Garden, okay? <laughs> Adventure 3. So that's just, just as personally me. Now, well, not really personally me, I've actually seen tons of videos talking about that same uh, discussion, but regardlessly, that's for another day. <laughs> um, anyways, so of course, we're, uh, in one part, you see like Knuckles kind of like running away from like some kind of egg robot that Eggman is, you know, controlling. It reminds me of like, uh, was it Knuckles Chaotix? A little bit without the whole rings thing, and, and especially for sure my favorite 2D Sonic game to date. To date, not not saying that this game is not gonna be better than Sonic CD because that's what it is. It's Sonic CD. Um, so, <laughs> especially when you when Knuckles was running, I barely paid attention to the word uh, like club spin or something in the background of that like scene because the, that stuff before like like that uh, that scene that sign like club spin uh, ages or Sega or whatever it was I forget. That's not the first time we've seen a sign kind of like that or reference of that from Sega. They, they put it in so many of their other games, uh, especially the newer games like Akiba's Beat. Uh, if you want to, by the way, that game is out now. Go check it out. Um, that, I think Tokyo uh, Xanadu, I could be wrong about that one. And just a bunch of other games. I think Z Jet Set Radio even had it, but regardlessly, uh, I think Shenmue as well, but I'm not sure. There, there, there were just you know so many references I probably wouldn't even catch, or at all, anyone. I mean, there's probably a certain reference in there that we don't even know. It's, so, anyways, at the end of the trailer, I just want to point out that we go back to the sketch art-like trailer part, you know, scenes, and I don't know, I just kind of, like, love seeing that, because you could really see, you know, it's not, like, perfect, 100%, you know, it's there, and you're like, okay, cool, you know, this is, like, just, just awesome, you know, it just makes you love how much Sonic has been loved by all fans and their own creators, but I do want to point this out, <laughs> um, I did... Notice with Game Explain, not not watching their you know video, knowing about it, but I did know about it before they even made a video because I watched it you know of course earlier that day when it came out. Uh, that in the Sonic Mania uh, trailer at the very end when uh, Sonic Knuckles and Tails is in the elevator and they're going up, before he picks up, you see like like uh like five buttons or something on this uh, elevator uh control switch thing, and there's uh, one two three, uh, K and M is at the very top. And I even knew this that referencing Sonic 1, 2, 3, and Knuckles, and then Mania. So that's what it referenced, was I knew that. The only thing that I didn't really pay attention to, and I mean the only thing I didn't pay attention to that little switch thing, was that the 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 speaker is shaped as a Chaos Emerald. That I didn't know. And I I knew about the emerald on the top, I didn't think much about it, but they're probably right when I saw Game playing the video of it. It, it probably is either the Master Emerald or the Super, Super Chaos Emeralds when you see as uh, Sonic 3 and Knuckles. So, that could be it, but or it could just be literally another Chaos Emerald shape, but I'm like, whatever. So, <laughs> um, yeah, but the biggest thing, I think, besides the whole animation, the gameplay, and, and, and so many other things being shown in the, game, in, in the trailer, is the date. We finally have ourselves an official, actual date. The official actual date is August 15 of 2017. Right now, as we're recording this, this is June 1st. I think. <laughs> I think it's June 1st, by the way. I don't really know. Uh, sorry, no, it's May 31st. Like, one day away from being June, uh, June 1st. I just want to point out that I have not pre-ordered my copy of Sonic Mania, but you can now pre-order Sonic Mania digital-wise on the PS4, Xbox One, and Steam. So you're probably saying, what was before? There was a collector's edition for Sonic Mania, and if you haven't pre-ordered that now, I'm gonna most likely go do that literally tomorrow if I can, and pre-order that because now that we actually have an official date, I like to pre-order when I know when stuff is actually coming out. Except for the one time I pre-ordered like Mighty, Mighty Number no. Nine and Rayman uh, Legends, and they all got delayed, and I had to cancel them. And I didn't pre-order them, but then I bought them, and I was like. Disappointed in one, and one I uh, was like, I, you know, I really love. So, hopefully, you guys guess which one. <laughs> so, anyways, yes, August 8th, 15th. I was say 18th. So August 15th, 2017. That's literally three months from now. Uh, so that or two and a half months. I don't know. Away from now. So I I'm pretty hyped for. It, of course, I'm a Sonic fan. I mean, duh. So who, you know, who wouldn't be if you're a Sonic fan? So, anyways. 
Oh, by the way, I totally forgot. Yeah, I'm sorry. The Switch version as well. There will be a Nintendo Switch version. So, my problem is, well, uh, what version will I be getting this on? Am I getting on the PS4 or the Nintendo Switch? At this moment in time, I would love to say PS4 or the Switch. Not Xbox One because, well, I feel like there's no reason for me to get a Sony game on the Xbox One. In, of course, if it's an exclusive game. <laughs> Sorry, that's that just my personal opinion. But, uh, yeah, you know, that, that's, that's seriously it. So, uh, oh, oh, by the way, very end, very end of the, uh, the trailer, like, 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 the last two or three seconds. I want to say maybe a second or two. Uh, at the very end, you see, like, a very old, nostalgic, like, animated, uh, scene for, like, two seconds of, of course, Sonic, Tails, and Knuckles going up to Sonic Mania. And that just looks so fucking familiar, and I, and please, and please tell me if I'm right or wrong, looks so fucking familiar to Sonic the Hedgehog the movie, the, the one that came back out in 1993 uh, or 4, some, some, some year like that, the one with Knuckles, uh, Knuckles wearing a freaking hat and, you know, doing the Archie comic, like, thing, so, yeah, you know, that, that, that animation looks so much like it, so much like it. And even a little bit, I guess I could say, of Sonic CD, if you want to go there. But you don't see Tails or Knuckles in that game, so, you know. You only see Amy the Rascal, which is Amy Rose, and uh, Robotnik, which is Eggman, of course. And, of course, Metal Sonic, but yeah, you know what I mean. So, I don't know, I'm just kind of curious of where this is kind of taking place, because it's... Please, please help me on this one, actually. Just This is one question, besides the whole animation thing. Um, <laughs> is this... I guess kind of taking it is taking place after Sonic and Knuckles, uh, Sonic Three and Knuckles, sorry. But where's Sonic CD and Sonic Four Episode One and uh, Sonic Advance, and including uh, uh, freak, I had another one in my mind. Uh, I would say Knuckles and Chaotix, but I'm not too sure about that. Regards to where does those games take place? Uh, because I guess I don't know. I'm, I'm assuming Sonic. CD takes place after Sonic Mania, I guess, if that makes sense. Maybe. <laughs> and then Sonic 4 Episode 1, I know they said it wasn't, uh, you know, like, part of the story, but what say it was, I would say Sonic 4 Episode 1 was probably after Sonic CD, if you know, and then, I don't know. I don't know, it's, it's just questions that go through my mind. <laughs> Where Sonic are, or and when, where Sonic the Fighters? Where do these take place? You know, I just have so many questions. And of course, the fan games don't count, as in Sonic pre sequel, Sonic the sequel, Sonic uh, Three Heroes. You know, stuff like that doesn't count. But hey, Sega. I mean, if you want, you know, try to get the license of those games, and you might put that on some consoles. You might start selling some shit. You know, <laughs> so. Anyways, realistically, thank you for all for watching. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe, leave a comment below. And I'll see you guys all for the next uh, video game discussion, which, who knows? It might be more Sonic Mania news. It might not be. Who really knows? And, of course, if, if, if there's anything I left out, please let me know in the comments below. Uh, but if, I do want to know what version of the uh, Sonic Mania will you be getting if you are getting it. Are you getting it on the PS4, Xbox One, uh, Steam, PC, or the Nintendo Switch? I'm just kind of curious, because for me, it's, like I said, PS4 or Nintendo Switch, and, and I'll figure out which one later on I really want. So, anyways, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys all for the next one, right? Bye.